Hey there, today we're going to take a look at how much mortgage can you afford with starting with a salary of $50,000 all the way to $260,000. Trust me, this video will be a hard, cold reality of how much mortgage can you afford. Let's take a look. Now, for the purpose of this video, we're going to take a look at a FHA loan first time home buyer. In this case, the rules are that you should use around 43% of your income towards the expenses of your home. This is known as a 43% debt to income ratio. Now let's take a look to the nitty gritty. You guys are not going to like this. $50,000 salary. For a $50,000 salary, your debt to income ratio of 43% means you, you should spend $1,800 for your home expenses. This includes your principal and your interest. But remember, once you transition from renter to homeowner, you also have other expenses. The other expenses that are commonly known are property taxes, private mortgage insurance, and homeowner's insurance. The private mortgage insurance is there because you put less than 20% down payment for the property. Now, based on these factors, you will be able to qualify for a home of $190,000. Now guys, this is the reason why it is hard to find videos out there of people showing how much can you afford if you have a salary of $50,000. Now, to be frank and honest with you, for $190,000, it will be almost impossible to find a property in the state of New Jersey. Other states, maybe in rural areas and other states, maybe in Pennsylvania, yes, you will find a home. Now, let's keep looking at more salaries. Now, if you make $60,000 based on the same factors, you will be able to qualify for a, a home of around $225,000, $230,000. If we keep going to $70,000, you will be able to qualify for $260,000, $270,000. At $80,000, we see that you can afford around a $300,000 home. Now, we will be able to find homes at, the, at these prices, but it depends on the area, the city, and the crime rate, and all these other stats. Now, if we hit the $90,000, now we see $339,000, $340,000. If you hit a $100,000 salary, now you're able to afford close to $400,000. However, at $120,000, so this is the sweet spot. If you make $100,000 $120,000, this is the sweet spot where you will be able to afford most of the homes in the state of New Jersey. Now, now for salaries of $140,000 to $160,000, now you start... Now you start being able to qualify for a home of half a million dollars to $600,000. Now this, trust me, there is a big difference between a property of $300,000, $400,000 and a $500,000 and $600,000 property. Trust me, it's a huge difference. Now, if you see now for one eighty dollars to $200,000, now you're able to qualify for $700,000, $750,000 property. And $200,000 and up, now we're talking about all the way to a million dollar property. Now, this is the reason why there are not that many videos of people explaining how much can you afford with a $50,000 salary. However, remember, this is not just you. You are able to combine your income with someone else, your spouse, your girlfriend, your partner, your brother, your sister. In this case, if you have a salary of $60,000, the other person is making $50,000. Now you guys are in a $110,000 range. Now you guys are able to qualify for a $400,000 home. Now we're in the sweet spot. Now here in this charge, remember guys, this charge is for educational purpose only, to know your very accurate numbers and speak to a lender. Now I made this charge to resemble what you can get approved for. Remember, this is based in the state of New Jersey with a property tax is around 2%, 2.1, 2.2%, depending on the area. Now in other states, the property taxes can play a huge, huge difference. As an example, let's just say if we have in a state where property taxes is 1.3%, Look at the difference now. Now for a $50,000 home, you're able to afford a $206,000, $210,000 home. $70,000, now we're getting close to the $300,000 range. To qualify for a medium home, for a medium price home, in a state where the property tax is around 1.3%, now we're looking that all you need to do, I mean, now we see that you need to make between nine dollars and $100,000 to be able to qualify for a $400,000 property. Again. There are many factors here in the state of New Jersey. So in the area that I'm based is around 2.3%. That will decrease your borrowing power. Now, I hope you find this video helpful. 
and very informative. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video with others that may find it helpful. Remember guys, my name is Billy Noguera, Realtor in the state of New Jersey. If you ever need a real estate agent, please contact me. My phone number will be here on the screen and on the description below. If you ever need to get in touch with me, feel free to text me, feel free to contact me on WhatsApp, or just fill up the form below and we'll get in touch. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.